Another planetary showdown. Isoflex is a showdown. Hexapro cookies and cream for the viewers. And versus Dimatize Elite Fusion Seven cookies and cream. Right here. Here we go. Everybody. Oh, you want to do a little head to head? A little head to head action. A little challenge. Here we go. <laughs> All, right. All right. We have our cup A, our cup B. I don't know which is which. You don't know which is which. I have no idea. They look very different color wise. We got one light uh, cookies and cream, one dark cookies and cream. Heck yeah. I don't know. I don't know which one's going to be which. I'm looking forward to the flavor. Cookies and cream uh, really should be kind of like a, a delicious treat you would have. You dunk those cookies in into that milk. But I do see pieces of cookie. It looks like little tiny pieces little, of Oreo. cookie chips in there. You know, going into them, we're gonna call them cookie pieces. Cookie pieces. All right, guys. So here we go. We're gonna start out with the light. Yep. All right. The light is also known as cup A, by the way. We had to check to see. But we don't know our, our assistant over here is handing us those. Not bad. Kind of a kind of a almost evaporated milk sort of taste. I'm not, you know, like I'm not digging it. You know, you're not <laughs> personally. Uh, I don't know that I'm a cookies and cream fan. I don't know that I can taste the cookies in this. I'm going to try one more. I mean, it's good for cookies and cream. I'm just not a big... I'm getting some kind of uh, aftertaste. Aftertaste. Yeah, a little bit of aftertaste on that one. It, like, it kind of has that, I, I said, evaporated milk. If any of you have ever had evaporated milk, can you put a little bit of water in there and mix it up? It kind of has a little bit of a... It's sort of close to milk, but not really milk. Yeah. Yeah. So, all right. Well, let's move on. Let's. Hey, on. we're not fancy. We're not. Uh, we don't have anything to cleanse our palates here. We're not drinking tea and. Yeah. You know, we're just gonna go right into it. None of that. None of that, because uh, this is the real world. <laughs> Woo! I'll be honest. I like that one even less. I was gonna say I liked it more. <laughs> <laughs> If you watch any of our showdowns, we're just about split every time on which we're one we're as honest as we can possibly be. And it, it's really not scripted. We're going right off the cuff here. Oof. Yeah, no, that one's not for me. Um, I'm going to go with cup A. And I'm going to go with B because that was more of what I, what I like in a cookies and cream. The first one was just a little bit too, maybe too much vanilla is what it was. I don't know. That might be it. It's probably the vanilla. Uh, definitely yeah, whereas vanilla. this was more cookie. So I would agree. I'm going to go with uh, B, and you're going I'm with gonna A. Go with, I'm going to go with A just because I have to. Quite frankly, I would not put this in my own pantry, but um, not because it's bad, but just because it's not my flavor. There you go. All right. And we'll reveal B. I've got A over here. So That's what it was. Hey, we ended up on what we uh, what we decided on. So I've got the uh, Dimatized Fusion 7 as my uh, favorite out of my two least favorite. So if you've watched the other showdowns, I picked the chocolate Hexapro, so apparently I am an All Max Nutrition Hexapro uh, fan of the flavoring and taste. And, and apparently I deviate from Hexapro, so. Yep. <laughs> apparently uh, you need to try something else. <laughs> Evidently. There so. you go. All right. Hey, Brad and Jeff here, because real knowledge is for real results.